welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I will be showing you another haul. I know I just uploaded a haul video not so long ago, but I got a few things, so let's get it on. Let me start off with some Avon stuff that I got from my friend, actually from my former workmate, who is one of my closest friends. This is the first one. It's the Avon Simply Pretty Color Last Lipstick. And it is in the shade Celebrity Red. I really like the packaging. It just comes in a plastic packaging. And I like how it is very compact. It's just very slim. And it just looks like a pen. Don't you think? <laughs> so it fits perfectly in my small bags. And it has a very secure cap. So um, you don't have to be scared on getting your bags dirty if the lid comes off. See? It's very hard to open. I really like that about this lipstick and I like the shape of the actual lipstick as well. That's the shape of it and it's very easy to carve out your lips and to really um, define your lips with this shape of the lipstick. And I really like it. I really like the shade as well. It's a very vibrant red-orange shade and I love it. So this is the total amount of the lipstick inside the tube and I think this is really worth it for only 119 pesos. This lipstick is actually very moisturizing on the lips. I've actually used it a, um, a couple of times already but I don't find that it really lasts on my lips like what the name suggests because when I eat it actually transfers on my food so yeah but it leaves a tint on my lips and I just think the price of 119 pesos is very worth the performance of this lipstick. Oh, well, here's a swatch of the lipstick. As you can see, it has a very vibrant red-orange shade. It's just perfect to amp up your look if you're just wearing minimal makeup or no makeup at all and you don't want to look sick. This is a great lipstick for that. All right, moving on to the next thing that I purchased from Avon. It is another one from the Simply Pretty line, and this is the Eyebrow Defining Pencil in the shade Brown. This is actually what I have on my brows right now. I just have a hint of brow mascara just to, um, come on dogs, come on, cooperate. I just have a hint of eyebrow mascara just to keep the brows in place and to give them a bit of tint. I'm so sorry about our barking dogs. But let me just give you a swatch so that you would be able to see the color. That's what it looks like right there. And I actually did like four swipes. But if you do it lightly, this is what the shade looks like. And it's a bit waxy and that's actually my preferred kind of formula for eyebrow pencils. It also glides on the brows really easily and no tugging of the brows whatsoever. So I really like that. Plus, this itty bitty cutie little brow pencil only cost me 49 pesos. And it's very nice just to put inside your makeup bag, like if you're on the go, because it's really small and it doesn't take up a lot of space. Plus, it is very cute. The next one is another one from the Simply Pretty line. Pretty. <laughs> the next one is another one from the Simply Pretty line. And it is the Eye Defining Pencil in the shade Black. I actually have this on my upper lash line and as my tight line today and it hasn't smudged, it hasn't smeared, at least I think it hasn't. No, it hasn't, especially on my crease since I have hooded eyes on um, this eye. <laughs> um, most eyeliners or all eyeliners I've tried actually smears on my crease right there. But this one didn't and I really like it so far. Um, this one also only cost me 49 pesos and it's very, very cute. I like how it is so travel friendly and it's very black. See? That's it right there and I just did one full swipe for the letter U for the I heart beat. Yes, I thought about dito yung ano, butas dito pa. <laughs> so yeah. I really like it. It's very creamy. No tugging on the eyelid at all. It's very easy to tight line with this kind of formula since it's very creamy. And one swipe lang, sulat agad. And I really like it. Alright, last one from Avon is a Simply Pretty Full Lash Mascara. I think I bought this for 179 pesos. Um, I'm not sure. I think I did that. Don't worry. All the prices will be in the description box below. And... Uh, I remember this was actually the same mascara that I used way back in high school and college but it was in a um, violet color like the whole mascara tube was in a violet color. I hope this is still the same formula because I really like how that mascara lengthens my lashes but we will see. I will let you know how it works 
Alright, moving on, my mom and I actually went to Japan Home Center and I just got this really cute mirror. So this mirror only cost me 66 pesos and let me just open this up so that you would be able to see what the mirror looks like. So this is what the mirror looks like. As you can see, it is very, very metallic and of course I chose the color pink. It's just really, really cute and this is how it looks like when you open it up. So that is what it looks like right there. That's your mirror. And then you can actually make this a stand so that you can see yourself when you are applying your makeup. Like that. And I really like it. I think it's just a really nice product for such an affordable price. And I love that it's pink. So cute. So cute. I just want to put it inside my bag. And then if I ride a jeepney or if I commute and then some mandorokot or magnanakao or kawatan or snatcher or mangungoot would just go up inside my bag and then he would feel this one and he would think that this is my wallet but ha! It's a mirror. You got a mirror worth 66 pesos so then. <laughs> Alright so that actually ends everything that I bought for myself. Actually my mirror, um, my ma ma'am, my mom bought that for me so... Anyway, we recently got a package or a balikbayan box from my tita from the US. It was actually full of clothes and I got a few clothes, but they were not gifts. Um, they were actually like, they had a business deal with my sister wherein... Oh my gosh. I just stained my shirt with lipstick. Uh, uh, the typical Ina. Very clumsy. So my aunt and my sister actually had a business deal wherein my aunt would um, send in a box full of clothes and just shoes and everything from the States. And then my sister would just... There's an airplane passing by. Sige, padaanin muna natin yung diva. Diva, stealing the show. What was I talking about? And then my sister would just pay her and basta, my business deal sila. So I got a few clothes, but that will be in a separate haul video. It will be on a fashion haul video. So today, we will be doing the US makeup haul. First, I got the e.l.f. Clarifying Pressed Powder, and this is in the shade Tone 1. It has a powder puff for free, and this is what the actual product looks like. As you can see, it actually matches me pretty well. It's the powder that I have on my face right now. It has been working great. Um, I'm not really looking super oily as of the moment, and I've had this makeup on for about one and a half hours, and usually I would already look like a grease ball when I don't use an oil control foundation, and today I'm not using an oil control foundation. So yeah, I think this powder is really good, and it's like that. Actually, we have this in the Philippines. Um, I've seen this in e.l.f. counters nationwide. Next up, I got the e.l.f. Professional Dramatic Lash Kit, and the packaging was actually busted in the shipping or in transit. But anyway, this is what it looks like. It looks very, very, very nice. I can't wait to try it out and just use it on my eyes and in a tutorial soon, you know? Yeah. So this is what the lashes look like up close. That's what it looks like right there. Do you see how glamorous that looks like? I just can't wait to use it. I love it. I love it so much. I love it. I love it. Okay, oh, Aina, oh, Aina. Next up, I got this lipstick. And this is the Elizabeth Arden Ceramide Plump Perfect Lipstick in the shade Perfect Rose. And it just comes in your typical classic lipstick packaging. And the color looks like this. Let me do a swatch right here. See? That is the shade right there. It's such a pretty shade just for everyday use. And I've been using it a lot lately since I got it because it's just perfect for everyday use and it's very moisturizing and it fades away gracefully on my lips and I love it. Next up, I got another powder and this is the Mary Kay Mineral Powder Foundation in the shade Ivory 2 and it looks like this. I really like how the cap is silver. I think it just adds a lot of glamour to the whole packaging and I've actually been using this a lot since I got it actually 
and it just looks like that. That's what the color looks like. It also matches me really, really well. And it adds a good amount of coverage to my face as well. Like if I'm not happy with the coverage that my foundation or BB cream has given me, I'll just add this on as a um, final powder and it just gives me the amount of coverage that I want and I love it. Go ahead, try this out for yourself. It will be worth the money, I promise you. All right, now moving on to some makeup brushes that I got. This is the first one, and it's just kind of like a uh, smudger brush. I don't know what this is called. Can you tell me what the name of this brush is? That's the shape right there. This is actually from the brand Estee Lauder. I don't know how to say it. Estee Lauder, Estee Lauder, Estee Lauder, whatever. But it looks like that and it's very soft and I like it. I haven't used it yet because it's just very short. You see, this is what my eye brush holder looks like and I have all my eye brushes in this case and I just made this case myself. <laughs> yes. Um, so yeah, it's really short as you can see. So it gets covered by these taller brushes and it's very hard for me to use it because I can't see it. Anyway, first world problems. I got another eye makeup brush and it actually looks similar to the Estee Lauder one. See? This is what it looks like. It's just a bit thicker or fatter than the Estee Lauder one. And it's also very soft. And I like the handle or the ferrule because it is very, very shimmery. As you can see, it has gold sparkles all over it. And it's just very nice to display this on your dresser or on your vanity because it's just super pretty. I really, I really like it. I really like it. <laughs> I really like it. I see it. It's the most shot. The next one is this Estee Lauder Gentle Eye Makeup Remover. It looks like this. And it also says here that it is for all skin types and that it is oil-free and fragrance-free. So I've actually used this three times already and I really like it for when I have like a dramatic eye look with waterproof mascara and waterproof eyeliner because it really removes all traces of makeup very very easily it doesn't tug on my lids I just put the product on a cotton pad or on a wet wipe and then I soak it on my eyes like this and then when I just drag it to the side all the makeup is instantly removed so I really like this and it comes in a really fancy packaging as well all right now we're down to the last item in this haul video and it is this limited edition insatiable caramel kiss body lotion from Victoria's Secret and this is what the packaging looks like as you can see it comes in a very very nice cute packaging um, do you see do you see the pink the orange and the gold and the mustard color and the brown oh, never mind the brown but the packaging is just super nice and I just love it I want to put it in my bag or just, I don't know, display in my vanity because it's so cute. I love it. It smells super nice as well. <sighs> smell it. Come on. I wish you could just smell it. Just smell it. Smell it. See now. I'm in mana. I'm in mana. I'm in mana. I'm in It smells so good. It actually smells like vanilla lace from Victoria's Secret or what's that called? Amber, amber, amber something. It also keeps my hands super soft and I keep it in my bag all the time because I just like having cute stuff in my bag. That is the last item in this haul video and I hope that you enjoyed watching. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to see more videos to help this plump caterpillar to become a butterfly. <laughs> and comment down below if you have any video requests or if you have any questions or suggestions or whatever, just leave your comments in the comment section below. I always reply to comments and I love hearing what you have to say. So again, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye!